Hi everybody and welcome back to the Fabulous Movement YouTube channel. I'm Tom Solid and I'm really excited today to talk about Craft. There's a big, big update that was just released for Craft. If you don't know Craft, I made a video about this. Uh, you can watch it here, where I show you my first impressions and so on about Craft. And it is the best Notion or Evernote alternative. And now listen, when it comes to note taking on the iPad. It is really, it is really strange when I go to the social media and I read something, what's the best note-taking app? And people answer Notion or Evernote or Notability, good notes. Why do you answer this? People are different. People have different needs. And I tell you what, I need to use Notion. I need to use Evernote and I use Craft as well. Why? Because I have different purposes that I need these tools for. So for example, Evernote I'm using solely for document scanning and management. Notion I use for database build up and connection, cross connection of databases. This both is not possible using Craft. So if people tell me, oh, I switched from Evernote to Notion because it's so much better. Yeah, it might be better for you because you might use it for note taking. It makes sense. But if you would use it for document scanning, <laughs> it's a dead end on Notion. So that's the same for Craft. How do I use Craft? I use Craft actually for private projects. Okay, it's it, nothing about my business goes into Craft yet. And I just like the style of craft. And this is really the big difference. And there we go. I have all the information there. It's beautifully laid out. I can just go here. I have all the information there. And it just looks awesome. This is the reason why I'm using craft. I have fun creating these projects. And they have a secret link that I can use. And I was able to publish it to the web. So this is was all functionalities that I could do with Notion or Evernote as well. Something that many Apple only tools rarely offer that proper as craft. On the other hand, it is tightly integrated into iOS and iPadOS and the macOS. So this means you can use craft really on all the different devices and it takes advantage of the built-in functionalities that we have here. And we have these great looking uh, sections here. And the big difference is really that when we integrate other pages, something that we can do in Notion as well, it shows you the previews of, the, of these pages. So I click on here, we jump to this page, we just tap on top and we can go back. And then for example, here we see this, you have card style, we can click on this card, we have, we can just swipe, then we select the boxes. So this is something that Notion could really learn from. But now they released a huge update, which allows you to access and edit your notes on the web browser. And this, in my opinion, makes it a no brainer to get craft now, because now you can access it from Windows and all the others like you can do for Notion, but with the advantage that you can much better edit it on the iPad. So if you're an iPad user, but you also want to access and edit your notes the same way as you use on the iPad, on your Mac, inside the web browser, this is now possible. And I tell you guys, you have to check this out. It is, it is hard to describe. It is really the styling and the feel of how you take your notes or build. I'm not, I'm not using it for note taking. I'm using it, as I said, for private projects. For example, if I want to build something or things like this, or collecting information for renovating a room or things like this, it will go in here and I will do this. I share it with my wife and it is all there. So make sure that you check this out. And if you're a craft user already and you didn't know this yet, make sure that you check out the new web editor. This is just a game changer. And if you want to see more about craft on this channel, please go to the comments below. Happy to show you more insights, how I use craft, how to use craft and tips and tricks. If you let me know that this is really what you want to see on this channel. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and I'll catch you up next time.